Why are you walking on the tree limb, babe? <laughs> <laughs> So Jeremy and I are on a little Ikea date. There's a kid area that Isaac and Elise are in and Caleb and Laura went to their like preschool art program that we take them to sometimes. They were excited. They were really happy there. Anyway, so we're gonna try to buy a couple things today to get our house more ready for baby. I am definitely nesting. So Jeremy's wanting to upgrade to a sit and stand desk in his office. These ones are just a lot cheaper and they're not digital. So it makes me feel like I can exercise while moving my desk up and down. It makes you feel like you're in your car rolling your windows down. Which we do. Because our car still has this kind <laughs> of a crank. I love it. I'm getting it. This is the desk. He's going to have so much more space. This desk is way bigger than his current desk. <laughs> the one that fit in our master closet? Yeah. Yeah. So we're looking at this thing. It is a storage spot for a bunch of our homeschool stuff, but it also has a little pull-down desk so the kids could actually do some of their schoolwork there. I'm thinking it might be a good solution. We could put it in the corner in our living room and that would open up some space in my bedroom where we're currently storing a bunch of homeschool stuff. We got some cinnamon rolls to power us through. Well, I'm worn out. So now I'm sitting here on the couches at Ikea while Jeremy and Isaac and Elise go and check on a few more things before we head home. Did you guys have fun? Yeah, I'm gonna stay a little bit longer. Oh man, it's time for your nap. But I have sand all over my Did you get sand all over? Yeah. Okay, let's wipe you off. Is that what you made? Uh huh, watch this. Watch this. Whoa. So you changed the background? Do you have a dolphin? Just, look what it actually is. Is it just two different cups? Mm-hmm. It's not oh. a dolphin. It's a what's that called? A whale? Let me show you the one that we Is it a, a shark? Ship. It's a rocket ship. Is it like a fish swimming in the sea? It looks like it's moving up. So we have spent the last five minutes playing with this rainbow reflection in our fridge. We discovered that it was coming from these colored cups over here, so we're adding new colors. Well, Jeremy and I are trying to clean out our closet. This is the uh, donate bag. I'm going through all my clothes that I just haven't worn in a long time, not just because I'm pregnant but just trying to sort through stuff that's not in good condition or doesn't fit anymore or I don't like anymore. We're cleaning up by bouncing the balls into here. You gonna come help us clean up the balls? Yeah. Okay, come on, we're going under the tramp to clean up. Look. Oh my. Good job, Laura. It is gorgeous out today and very, very bright and sunny, but it's so nice to be able to be outside. Here he Bonnie. is. Bonnie is coming outside to play. Hey guys, this is Bonnie's first time in grass. Oh, he's doing good. Hey, Bonnie. She standing on you? Does it hurt? No. Just one. There we go. <laughs> so gentle. It's Good so job. fun. Oh. Isaac, you wanna try? So with it being so warm out today, we decided we're gonna bring the chicks out just for a few minutes and let them explore on the grass. Oh, sorry. Here's Tiana's turn. Oh my. He wants wow. to play tag. Are you gonna try to play tag with Tiana? <laughs> <laughs> this one's a worse. <laughs> She'll get ya. <laughs> 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 
It's so fun with these chicks that you can see their different personalities. Like Tiana is always more adventurous. Do you like the grass? No. <laughs> Why is this still funny? <laughs> well, it's funny bringing the chicks back in and putting them back into their little cage with their warmer. You kind of wonder what they're thinking of that experience. Like that was their first time outside ever. That was their first time in a bigger space and like, are they talking to each other about it? Do chickens talk to each other? What do you think, Lisey? I think they do, because they like chirping. You're going high, Miss Laura. Yeah, I am. You're flying. She's doing not as big as me. Dad, can you give me some pushes? You need a push? So for about the last month, every time I look out of my kitchen window when I'm doing my dishes, I'm so annoyed because there's been this disposable plastic bag stuck in a tree in our backyard. And it was a little bit too high up where we couldn't just go out and grab it. And we haven't been outside much because it's been so cold. And so every time I'm doing dishes, I'm like, oh, we need to go out and grab that bag. So now we're outside playing with the chicks and I'm like, Jeremy, you gotta go grab that bag. And he's uh, taking a creative route to get there. You gotta see this. Why are you walking on the tree limb, babe? There's a lot of poking trees down there, and this was a lot more fun. What if you fall? He has a stick. He's going for it with a stick. Jeremy's taking the easiest route possible <laughs> to get this bag. Why don't you just walk over underneath it? That's too easy. <laughs> You're almost there, babe. <laughs> Dad, you want me to help? I got it, kid. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! My hero! <laughs> you got it, babe. <laughs> How you doing, big boy? Good. I found somewhere to sit. Yeah, you did. You found a great little spot to sit. Yeah, Laura wants to sit right by you. One second. Whoa, big jump! <laughs> Good job, big girl. Here he comes. Triumphant. Good job. So the reason that I was climbing on the log is because there's burrs and bushes and thorns in the undergrowth that I was trying to avoid. Otherwise, it can take hours to like deburr your shirt from all of this stuff in It's there. true. Thanks. You saved us all. No problem. Mom? Do you want to come inside with me and look at the baby girl clothes? Yeah! Do you want to? Huh? What are you going to do with them? Open it. Open it? But I can't. Okay. It's I'll. too hard. Well, I'll help you open it, and then we'll look at the baby girl clothes together. Who are the baby girl clothes for, Laura? Baby girl! For baby girl, this baby girl, huh? Yeah. <laughs> I think he loves me. I feel like the baby needs to be a little me. bigger. I think I love her. Oh, I know you love her. Oh. And I can touch her. Yeah. And I can lay on her. Oh, you can't lay on her when she's born. Spontaneous cuteness. You guys are awesome. Okay, let's go look at the baby girl clothes. So I found the newborn girl box yesterday, and now I haven't had a chance to go through it yet, but I thought it'd be fun for Elise and Laura to go through it with me because you guys wore all these clothes. Yeah. I love yeah, the when I was a baby. Suit. Yes, when you were a baby. Okay, I shall we see what's in here? Pumpkin suit. This was a Halloween costume. For all babies. Yeah, everybody in our family is a pumpkin at the beginning. Okay, but look, these are you guys' blankets and burp cloths and your swimsuit. So everyone was your swimsuit. And drilled on them. Oh, yes. look, these are clothes for the baby. Yeah, that's I a dress. Feel like the babies yeah, yeah. smell like drool. They're good. drool. They do sometimes. We have to give them back. It doesn't fit me. This yeah. doesn't fit you. This is for the spit. That is for the spit. <laughs> Where's the milk? Hey, this is for the spit too. Yeah, these are called burp cloths. Okay, is this is a nursing cover. Whoa, oh, why is what? These ones are Is blankets. this for the car seat? Yeah, that one goes over the car seat. Wow. Oh, I love this blanket. I love this blanket too. 
Those ones are special. Those are your blessing blankets. These are so cute. This is your blessing dress for church. My blessing dress? Yeah, you guys were both blessed look. tonight. Oh, so look how cute. cute. You had us wear bracelets? Yeah, that's your bracelet. And these? Yeah, do you guys want to get out the bracelet? Look. This is little little for a baby. Look, these are the little baby girl's shoes. These are cool. They are, they're cool little shoes. Open. Look how little they are. Yeah. You know you wore these when you were a little baby? Yeah, in your tummy. Not inside my tummy, you didn't wear them. I can wear it just like a baby. Oh, you can wear that one? Yeah. Daddy's little bib. angel. Yeah. It's a bib. So I wanted to show you some of these special ones that are right here at the bottom. This <gasps> was your coming home from the hospital outfit. This is what we brought you home from the hospital in. It's so cute. cute. It's soft too, because you were born in the winter time, so I wanted you to be nice and warm. Mm -hmm. Then we had one for Laura too. This was Laura's. Oh, I love that one. Isn't that fun? It's so that's cute. what she came home from the hospital in. Good night. So I usually do darker colors, but this time I decided to go with a baby pink. Isaac claims that he can get his lips to touch his nose. 